Alrighty, welcome to the first episode of Settlement Sunday. Uh, this is on a different save, and I will be showing off Sunshine's Tiding. Now, in this lore of this save, Sunshine's Tiding is a powerhouse. It's larger than Sanctuary, and it's where I rebuilt the Minutemen from. And here's a little fun fact. I also got I platinum the game in this settlement. This exact same same this exact settlement. I platinum the game by reaching 100 happiness. So since this place is very far off in the Commonwealth, it has no walls. Here's the guard, still equipped in the Titans militia armor. Here is the gun shop. One of my old rifles. I showed this off before, but it's the scabber shack. Here's a communal house. My old bedroom, the first thing that I built here. Now I just use it as an overflow area for power armor. Here's another clothing shop. Can't remember the last time I had clean Here's the meeting area where the citizens meet up, where the representatives of settlements meet up. This is a place that I can't get a goal out of, but it would normally be a, a bathing area. Here's my old house. For this settlement, I chose... Alright, here's another house. I decided for this settlement that I would choose gigantic boxes as my house, as opposed to something more symmetrical. I'll show off my house in the end of the tour. Here's a restaurant. It has a bar and an area where you can buy food. Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Here's an armor store. Not much back there. I haven't really played this one since October 6, 2023. Is be that's because I got my old save from 2022 back. The one that I do all my settlement tours on. Here's Anne. Fun fact about Anne, if you put her in a uh, top tier clothing shop, she will give you we rare clothing, like a, you like a uh, press we'll and garbage duster. Uh, if you put her in a level three one, she'll give you a colonial duster, which is press and garbage duster. She also produces her clothing back here. This is the first settlement of mass production. Okay, we'll move on from here to... Move on from here to... Never thought a reporter could consider themselves a success until someone threatened their life. A second diner. I'm very successful. There are a lot of businesses here is because I needed first. to... Can I set you up? Uh, because I needed to uh, get this settlement maxed out with happiness, which was extremely hard and pointless. Here's an old guard. Got to take things one day at a time. Here's the shooting range. I was actually tearing this building down. I guess I just stopped halfway. No 
Nothing's more satisfying than a smoking gun and a pocket full of cash. Here's a train there. Here's barracks for the Tidings Militia. I'll write some lore. I'll actually know the lore, but I'll write about the lore uh, later. And here is a medical area. Yes. And, well, power shed. Now I show off the gigantic mansion. Okay, so here's my house. I based it off the house that I built in 2019. Which was kind of open air like this. What I wouldn't give for a good stiff drink. Here's my collection of magazines. My living area. My bar area, uh, my personal terminal, all the bobbleheads I have. Now this place isn't done yet, so it's gonna need more lights. Here is the first set of Outcast power armor. Creation club oh, stuff. And weapon rack. So where are we off to next? You know what I call ends without an empty stomach. Here's all the live reaction rifles that I found. And I haven't even been to Fort Harbor yet in this safe. All the Nuka World Creation Club things. And a colonial duster that I bought from Anne. And this is not finished yet. But this would be another power armor level. Ooh, here's my special one. The Minutemen armor. Minutemen Hellfire armor. Yes, me darling. So yeah, that is the Sunshine Tidings uh, City. Sunshine Tidings Town, I suppose. I'll do it in the bonus settlement. Which is... Alright, so... This is the... Oberland Station, which was the first major settlement that joined the Titans Militia. It supplied most of the food while Titans supplied the protection. Here's the living area. Bars. Here is the power shed. And that's the sleeping area. I don't know how this happened, but it's pretty funny. Here's a scavenger area, general store, chem area, and food storage area. This is where they keep all the food that they send off in caravans. Another power area. And there's the Tiding Spirits. And yeah, settlement Sunday number one.